Are you addicted to screens? According to a tech study by Assurian, Americans check their cell phones anywhere between 80 to 300 times a day, capturing an average of 11 hours of screen time between sunup and sundown. There's this constant scrolling through the viral videos and the trends, the likes, the celebrity obsessions, the politics. But how much can we really take before our minds begin to break down? It's time to stop. It's time to stop, okay? Former Google insider Tristan Harris says that as tech companies like Facebook and YouTube upgrade technology, they're downgrading humans. People are seeing these things as, as disconnected. Outrageification of our politics, right. teen addiction to mental health issues, social isolation. They're all part of the business model of extracting human attention. The race to the bottom of the brainstem. According to the Center for Humane Technology, the addiction to the screens is responsible for shortened attention spans and a variety of mental health issues. Lila Geis is a clinician for the Military Family Clinic at Endeavors. She says for some people, upgrading their mental health starts with simply logging off and being present. And so while you're watching somebody live their life through something that may not be 100% real, it could be making you depressed, it could be making you anxious, thinking you have to compare yourself to them. And so that can affect your mental health and how you think, how you feel, and how you act. John Coker, Kins 5, Eyewitness News.